All right, good evening, everybody. I, I just sat down, and uh, I'm trying to figure out what to do because it's pretty cold right now, and I'm wondering how, what to leave open because when I play Street Fighter, I usually warm up, like, a lot. Uh, my adrenaline gets pumping, basically, and it gets me all worked up. And when that happens, you know, uh, you know, I basically get uh, my temperature, my body temperature goes up. And uh, so I'm thinking, should I leave it open or not? Because right now I'm cold. I'm actually legit cold sitting here. But I don't know how much I'm going to warm up when we actually start playing. So I guess we have to see. Uh, I think I may turn the fan off entirely for now. Hold on. I'm going to just turn it off. Piece of shit. I'm, pu I'm punching my computer. It's loud. It must be a loose fan. I don't just want it at the bottom. I just want it at the top. This thing's a piece of shit. It's too loud. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Loud ass PC. I wonder what fan it is that's doing that. Oh my god. It won't shut up. Basically. My PC is getting as loud as my air conditioner. <laughs> Seriously. I mean, it is a 10-year-old PC at this point, or about to be, right? Like, like, by next summer, it'll be 10 years old. So all the fans now are starting to make, like, annoying noises that they're not supposed to make. So it just means they're all getting fucking worn out and shit, you know? But, you know, when you have a loose fan, all you gotta do is, like, get it to realign. So... Sometimes slapping it actually works. I'm serious. Like, sometimes you just slap a computer around, it'll work. It, like, everything sounds good now, you know? Um, I don't know. It's loud. You hear it? Do you hear it? It's fucking making tons of noise right now. If I just turn it away from me, it might make less noise, but I don't know if that'll work because that might pull wires and shit. Maybe I should try, though, because it's fucking loud, man. Let me see what happens. Hold on.
Okay, what a piece of shit. All right. We're good now? Yeah, I was moving the, the PC around. What I did is I actually put it, quite frankly, into a better position than it was. I put it more firmly on that piece of cardboard that it sits on and aimed it more towards the wall. So even though it's making noise, it's not like overwhelmingly loud and distracting. And my capture device, which was teetering on the edge over here for a while, I actually put on top of like a box. So now it's standing out better. It's, it's not like falling off the edge of my, my TV stand. I think now what I'll do, I will open the window further because I turned the fan off and then we'll be good to start. Like, holy crap, what a setup, right? <clears throat> okay, let me open the window and then we'll, we'll talk and get started. <clears throat> So, the good news, and yes, there is good news, is that hopefully we've seen the last of the issues with the internet, although it's not guaranteed. Um, you know, there's been a million developments. Uh, I talked about it earlier today. I revealed the entire situation of what's going on um, with Comcast and how it's a Comcast employee who maliciously was doing this to me for months, if not years. And that's why my internet would periodically go up and down and up and down and screw up. But it seems so weird the way it was happening and we couldn't really figure out what the cause was. Now we know the cause. We finally figured it out. And as of the end of the stream earlier, all right. Um, by the way, you guys all hear everything's good? You can hear and see me? Everything's good? We're good? Okay, so basically by the end of the last stream, uh, Comcast is aware of all of it. They have found the evidence of it. They have confirmed this is happening. And they are going to deal with it. Okay? Now, here's the thing. Here, here's my attitude anyway. Okay? If this guy is about to get shit-canned, fired, whatever it may be, arrested, because who knows? Because this is... Now, it wasn't just he was turning my modem off. He actually committed identity theft and did a payment in my name without my authorization. That's a crime. That's actually fraud. Okay, so whatever they choose to do to go after this guy, the way I see it is like, this is his bla last blaze of glory, right? So if he has, if he's working tomorrow, I feel like he's gonna go all out and try to kill my stream again. Would he? Would he not? Right? <laughs> right? <laughs> so that's what I mean. Like, if, if you're in a situation where, uh. Where, you, you know, this person already has done crimes. He's now caught out and is about to get into massive trouble for it. Um, would this person not just try to mess with my streams the last hurrah? It's weird because I thought maybe he would do it tonight. But I feel I really feel like this is a person who clocks in and out at a job. And so they're not working right now. That's why my night streams have never been affected by this person once. It's only been day streams. And it's only been certain times like... The Wednesday before Thanksgiving, he tried to mess with my internet. Not on Thanksgiving or on Black Friday when I was doing marathons, but the Wednesday before. Likely because that was the time he was working right before Thanksgiving. You know what I'm saying? So, anyway, I really feel like that's the case. Like, this guy likely only works certain shifts, only has access to, you know, the network or whatever during certain times of day and certain days of the week. Uh, I could be wrong. Tonight, if the internet goes out, you know then I'm wrong, but who knows? We're just speculating, right? Like we don't actually know. We're all just speculating here of the extent of what this is. But Comcast has told me, yes, they have confirmed everything that I've said. They found it all and they're taking care of it internally, supposedly, all right? But the way I see it is it's probably not over. There may still be a day or two of nonsense until whatever is going to happen happens, right? So tonight, my intention is to play two hours or so of Dalsim in Street Fighter 6. This is my final session of casual play. And what I mean by that is after today, I want to take him into ranked and try to play ranked. But I don't know uh, how that's going to go. You know, I haven't even played a lot of the cast yet. I did watch two videos last night. Two. I watched it was about 45 minutes of Dalsim gameplay. And I saw some interesting stuff. You know, I'm so dumb. I totally forgot that his 
uh, standing roundhouse kick um, actually cancels into a fireball. Uno Nuno, enjoy your ban. Um, anyway, yeah, his standing roundhouse kick actually cancels right into a fireball, which I've totally forgotten about. Um, so that's a useful thing. Anytime you do that, it helps push them back further. Um, in addition to that, like a lot of people keep just doing cancels into his float and then back down. I don't do that. Like I jump and do the float, but apparently you can do a lot of things that cancel right into float and then do a combo right after like floating down. You try to hit like a jumping kick or whatever. And if it hits, you could lead to a big combo. So I should totally do that. I got I think it's just down in two kicks. I believe is how you float manually from the ground. That's what I got to figure out. Like how do you float manually off the, from the ground? Cause in the air it's down in two kicks, but I think it's the same input from the ground is down in two kicks. So you could do like a hit string, float, cancel the float into another attack attempt and stuff like that. Um, so I need to try some of that because there's like combo mix-ups of things people have been doing or better combos, some of the better combos I've, than I've been doing. And one other thing, the top doll teams are not using Yoga Flame at all. They actually use Yoga Blast, which is the upwards blast because it two and ones after that into the level three super. Or if it combos, you can instantly do the level two super, which hits for extra damage too. So... I gotta get into the muscle memory that when I'm doing combos with Dalsim, I'm canceling into, I believe it's the medium kick upwards yoga blast instead of the yoga flame. So instead of using kick, I now gotta use, excuse me, instead of using punch, I now gotta use kick. <clears throat> so in fact, why don't we test both of those things right now and then we'll begin, okay? Let's actually do that. Let's actually test those things right now and then we will, uh, we'll see what happens, okay? Fair enough. But guess what, I'm getting a phone call, so hold on. Nothing important. Okay. I'm going to actually turn my phone off so I don't pay any attention to it uh, tonight while we're playing and everything. Okay. Stupid. Stupid thing. Okay. So. <clears throat> um, ah. So basically, uh, I want to just quickly go into training mode, try a couple things, and then we're going to get started. Guys, tonight, please, if you can support the stream, please do. You know, I'm coming off of trying to make up with the fact that yesterday I didn't get to do my stream properly at all. It all got screwed up. And then when I played my makeup stream at night of Modern Warfare 3, it didn't really work because people weren't there for that. They wanted, you know, Like a Dragon, and I wasn't there for Like a Dragon. And then on top of that, now earlier today, you know, I didn't get to do my stream. The good news is people did show up to hear my story about Comcast, and they did support that stream. But it would be great if you could support Street Fighter tonight. If you enjoy it, thank you. Let's quickly jump into training to try those two quick things and then we'll get started.